Hi everyone, Zori Mori here. Welcome to my channel. Today I have for you a very special vlog. I'm gonna take you to one of Cezanne's Paris stores and to the October Editions Boutique. You might have seen a few of the things I tried during my visit on Facebook or Instagram. If you're active on those platforms, I'm gonna include links in the description box below. Stop by and say hi. On Facebook, I share discount codes, sale alerts, restock alerts, and new collection gossip. And on Instagram, I actually have two. One is dedicated to daily outfits and the other one to my travels. Like currently, I'm exploring Europe's Christmas markets. So if you want to follow along, I'd love to see you there. If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. I'd love to see you around more. Now let's get into today's video. I was only in Paris for a day and a half before leaving for the Christmas markets, but I knew I had to come to the Cezanne store to set the mood for my whole trip right. I am returning to Paris later in December and I'm planning to do most of my Christmas shopping here. So this was kind of like a planning mission. I love this location. They have a lot of choice. They have this huge wall of bags. I finally got to see the pink Milo bag. It is beautiful in person. The colors are really unique and I am tempted to get it just to wear it with this pink gym coat. Together they make for the most perfect monochromatic pink look. I know it's not a practical choice, but a girl can dream, right? <laughs> Last time I didn't show you the interior of the Ferro bag, so here it is. The Ferro was my very first Cezanne bag. I really like it. It fits quite a bit. It's one big compartment. You can really organize your things, but there are ways around that. You can get little pouches to separate your belongings and you will really enjoy it. It's one of the bags I really recommend for a starter introductory bag from Cezanne, if you wish. This is the mini version of the Ferro. I like this size for summer and now I'm really curious about the micro version they introduced. I kind of want to see it side by side, the micro and the mini. I think there is a limit on how small you can go for a bag and still have it being functional. Stay tuned next time I'm near a store, I'll compare the mini and the micro. Next, I previewed all the shoes and shoes are my kryptonite. I had really hard time containing myself. I wanted to get all of these. If I had to only shop one category until the rest of my life, it would be shoes. I ended up getting these pink ankle boots, but I was torn between them and the knee high peony boots. What do you think? Did I make the right choice? I'm definitely going to style them once I'm back in San Francisco. They also had in stock the collaboration prints. These were released the day I left for Europe. So it was really fun to see them so quickly after the release. And of course, I took a few to the fitting room because I really wanted to see how they fit. The Paris store was stocked to the brim with gift options. I love the jewelry cases. They make for fantastic gifts. The laptop cases I missed. I, I don't know if they were online or maybe I wasn't looking. I think they're also great gifts. They look like little pieces of art. I personally work from home. I don't use a laptop case, but if I was still going to the office, I would probably, I would have snagged one. The store also gift wrapped your items. I really like the minimalist, beautiful aesthetic of these boxes with the copper ribbons. And if you are on the market for gifts, I recommend you look into Cezanne's belts. They are a crowd pleaser gift so many beautiful designs and colors that can be matched to every personality. It's a really versatile and functional piece that makes a statement. You can never go wrong with choosing one of these rainbow options that are displayed here. I thought the display at the store was really, really outstanding. Another iconic item is Cezanne's perfume. It's that gorgeous smell that comes out of the package when you receive your order. They have two sizes. They have the big bottle and they have the small bottle. At the fitting rooms, I tried the dune skirt. It looked gorgeous, medium weight, lined. 
I paired it with this lightweight knit. I thought it creates a visual balance between the heavier bottom, the flow of the skirt and the more airy top. It's a really classy combination. I know it's currently sold out, but I think Cezanne is gonna make a push for the holidays. So keep checking your wish list for restocks. Next, I tried the Piro shirt. I love the print, really tropical. The material, it's very thin, it's slightly see-through. I think the material matches the aesthetic of the print, makes me think of summer. If you get it now, you can look forward to wearing it during the summer months. And last but not least, I tried the wheel jacket. Looks like a painting. You can't quite tell on the website, but the material is velvety soft. It feels like you are wearing a cozy hug. It's a statement piece, really unique in nature. Next, it was time to walk up the street to the October Editions Boutique. I love taking Henry here when we're in town because he's a very picky shopper. He would never keep an item if it's itchy or if it doesn't fit him properly. I discovered that taking him to the store and stocking his wardrobe for the whole season is the best way to go. So here are our favorites if you're looking for gifts. This Lancy red jumper cable knit, no itch, will make any man in your life so happy because it has the aesthetic angle, but it's also really comfortable. Then we have the Dennis in green. It's a complex green color. They are speckles of other colors that are weaved into the body of the sweater. It adds complexity, it's soft, Another great option is the wool jacket. This particular one is executed in wool. It was one of Henry's favorite things that he tried. I think this colorway is universal. It goes with so many things. You can layer it on top of a t-shirt or when it's colder, you can layer it on top of a sweater. It's really a timeless classic piece. Next, if you're looking for a more fun gift, that is really really holiday this Kaloum jumper I think will stand out in your family photos and it also comes into this green color when I saw it on the tablet I thought the green is better but seeing it on Henry I think the white worked better for him so we went with the white one if you follow him on Instagram you probably have seen him wear it all the time and last but not least this watch that is a collaboration between October and Lip is a really unique, gorgeous gift. All right, everyone, this is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below what you think of today's video and what do you hope to find underneath the Christmas tree this year. If you enjoy watching, give this video a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. I'd love to see you around more. Have a wonderful week and see you next time.